Hey everyone, this is DHTV and today I have another tip for you PlayStation 4 users out there. Today's tip is all about typing and I'm going to show you how you can use your smartphone or your tablet to type on the PS4. Let's get started. Alright, now as I said, you could do this on pretty much any tablet or smartphone, either an Android or iOS device, and it should work just as I'm showing you right here, but for this example, I'll show you on my iPhone, and the first thing we want to do is go into the App Store and install and download the PlayStation app, so just go ahead and type in PlayStation, when it appears, go ahead and install it. Once the app has installed, you want to go ahead and open it up, and we'll go ahead and quickly accept these terms or the user agreement here, and the app will load up. Alright, so as you can see, there's a lot of stuff you can actually do with this app, but for this video, we'll focus on the keyboard. So what you want to do first is turn on your PlayStation 4, and then once it's turned on, we'll go ahead and tap Connect to PS4 here. And as you can see, mine has already popped up, but if yours doesn't, you can go ahead and tap the Refresh button up here, and it'll search out your PlayStation 4. Once it's found your PlayStation, you want to go ahead and tap on it. And it'll set you up. You need to put in your email and your password that you use on your PSN network uh, from your PlayStation. So I'm going to go ahead and do that. All right. And once you've signed in, it should prompt you to this page right here. And now what we need to do is actually go into the settings on our PlayStation itself. So we'll go to the settings section. We'll scroll down to where it says PlayStation app connection settings. And what we're going to do here is tap on add device and you want to enter in the number that appears on your PlayStation 4 screen in the app on your smartphone or your tablet. So we'll go ahead and do that. And now we have connected. You can see on my PlayStation 4, the connected prompt appeared as well as on the app itself. Now from the app, you can actually see we have a few more settings that we can access here. And the one that will give us the keyboard is the second screen. So what we're going to do is actually go into a section here. We'll go to the messaging section on the PlayStation and we'll create a message. And let's just go to this person here. And what we're going to do is use the keyboard from our smartphone. So what we do is tap on second screen here and it'll take you to this page and you tap up here where it has the little keyboard. Now if you take a look at the little screen, you'll be able to see that whatever I type here on the keyboard will appear on the PlayStation. And there you go. Now you can use your smartphone or tablet keyboard with your PlayStation 4. And for those of you that purchased that little accessory for the PlayStation 3 controller, this is going to save you some money because you always have your smartphone or your tablet around. And this will just be really quick. Anyway, guys, if you found this helpful or enjoyable, hit that like button. It helps me out a lot. And if you've missed any of my PlayStation 4 coverage, there's a link in the description. It'll take you to all the videos with lots of tips and tricks that you can use with your PS4. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe. I post videos Monday, Wednesday, and Friday, and I will see you in the next one.